What's up everybody, I'm John. So I'm gonna be working on the Honda a little bit today. Uh, but really I just wanted to show you kind of uh, like our progress on it. So you know how Marvin, he got the headlights last video. I actually put the grill on too just to um, show you what it looks like. Headlights look way cleaner as you can see. And then the grill doesn't look too bad. I mean, it's just dusty and stuff, but yeah, the headlights look way, way better than last time. I've also been kind of like painting a couple of trim pieces. Uh, for example, you know how we took off the fender last time? The fender itself has a little, excuse me, has a little trim piece. Fender's still back here. Uh, right here? Well, that's what I'm also, uh, I've been painting it. So what it looks like, I just did it black, just a stock black. Also the window trim that goes here, that's black too, just finished it this morning. And I also got a wheel done, just one wheel so far. Um, took the hubcap off, here's the hubcap. Uh, so here's what it looks like, it's pretty clean. Just did a, the matte black, or not matte black, it's just uh, semi-gloss black. Same color as the trim and uh, the grill, same color. Uh, so I did like two, three coats of black. So I sanded the wheel down with 220, uh, wet sand it, Marvin helped me out a bunch. And that's pretty much it, I didn't do anything uh, thinner, just cause it's steel, so I mean, you know, it, it's pretty smooth with that 220. Um, so that's what I did there, and then the trim pieces, I started with uh, 400, and it just kinda went up to 1000. And uh, I think that's all I did, just up to 1000. Um, oh, let me show you what the dogs did too. So you know how we took the fender off? These dumb dogs bit the cables, because there's a cable that was, some cables that were running from here to this part here. It's this part. Uh, can you see it? Yeah. Those two parts here, that was one. The dogs bit some, some of it off. Here's, here's some right here. And here's some right here. And here's some right here. So now I'm forced to rewire all the, um, the speakers. Because um, this is all speaker wire. I'm not sure what this is, but it's something to do with ground, I'm sure. But yeah, all the speaker wires I gotta redo. But today I'm gonna be working on painting the car itself. I finally chose what color I'm gonna paint it. Uh, the only trouble that I had was that um, I forgot to buy primer. But luckily I found some in the back because my dad has a grip load of paint that he doesn't know about. I'm gonna start on the gas uh, cover, the gas cover here, um, just cause it's like the smaller piece and I just wanna see what it looks, what it looks like. The color that I'm gonna be painting it is this. Um, I believe maybe that's what the color is called, St. Tropez. I kinda messed up on the, on the trim color cause as you can see here it says high gloss so it's gonna be really glossy which is what I wanted. But, for the black that I bought, it's just semi-gloss, semi semi-gloss black, and that's why it looks like the way it does. I think this is gonna be a lot shinier, um, and that's what I wanted, I, even for the black, but it's fine. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go uh, with this uh, wheel thing, this, uh, what's it called? Wire brush wheel, and try to remove all this gray. It has a couple coats of two different grays, because they repainted it. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna take, I'm gonna see how this works. I can see some, uh, some metal here now. I don't know how long this is gonna take me, but yeah, I can see some metal there, so that's pretty much I mean, I'm going to keep doing that until I see metal on all of that. So I took most of it out, um, at least this front part of it. There's some on the edges all around still. You can kind of tell, but all this is pretty much done. So I'm going to go ahead and try to take this whole thing off and get around the edges. Well, maybe just open it and get around the edges, then take it off and do a do the rest.
that's all I'm gonna do with the with the drill. The battery's dying anyway, so I'm just gonna go ahead and get some 220. I'm sure that I have to do a little bit uh, thicker grit, but the lowest I have is 220. So I'm just try to hit it with 220, see how it looks, because it looks pretty scratched up because of the swirlies. But I'm pretty sure we can even that out. still kind of see the swirlies and stuff um, the 220 is actually making them like soft so you can't feel that the ridges and stuff that it makes it just kind of makes it even so that's good I thought it wasn't gonna work but it does So I just hit it with uh, 220, and it's really smooth actually. I thought it was gonna be a lot, a lot rougher than than it feels like it, but just to be safe, I'm gonna hit it with 800 grip. Um, just, just literally, just to be safe. Uh, then I'm gonna wash it, and then I'm gonna paint it. wait for it to dry to sun dry it then I'll hit it with alcohol after it dries and then I'll prime it and then I'll paint it and then put it back on the car Now I just wait 10 minutes for it to dry and then I'll just do another coat. I might do like three, four coats or five coats because my sister says that the, um, the little scratches were still kind of noticeable when she touched it with her nail. Hi. But, hi. Yeah, but we'll see. While we wait for the primer to dry, I'm just gonna play some kickball with Jonah. It's been like five or six minutes. the camera can get the imperfections but my sister was right you can see a bunch of the swirlies um, there's some right there I don't know if I'm gonna care too much about it if I mean if uh, if I don't like it by the time I'm done priming it then I'll probably just do it tomorrow like I won't paint it and I'll send all this oh I just touched it I'll just sand all this down tomorrow again, just even it out, and then another like 
one or two coats of primer and then actually paint it but I'll just give it another maybe another coat or two and see if I like it or not if it's not too noticeable then I won't really care but if it is I'll have to sand it down tomorrow so I just did the fourth coat and yeah you could still see the swirls it kind of looks like I don't know like wrinkled skin it looks pretty gross so I guess this is gonna be the the last primer coat tomorrow I'll sand it down and try to get those try to get those wrinkles out and then paint it blue oh, what's up everybody so I gotta do this real quick cuz it's Tuesday I didn't get to do anything yesterday and uh, it's about to get dark you can tell no today's a Tuesday um, and this thing needs to get fixed it's you can still see the swirls there um, so that's what I'm be working on right now I might not record it because I'm running out of battery too but I'm just gonna sand it down I think I have 220 230 to sand it down and um, and then just kind of go up from there so we'll see how this looks all right so I just kind of sand it with 220 and this is what it looks like hopefully you can see that Jonah's over there just jumping on the car um, I don't know how bad this is like I've never done this before so it feels smooth but it's, it felt smooth the first time too so I'm just sanding a little bit more down I guess and then just go up in, in grit of sandpaper feels the same like it doesn't feel very bumpy hi Jonah like it doesn't feel very it doesn't feel bumpy but it could be my fingers they're like completely feelless like I can't feel anything like they're kind of I don't even know what if it's if it's dust or oh wait 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 I guess it feels kind of bumpy there let's try it again I don't know. I'll just leave it like that. Just go up and go up and grit now. So that was 220. Yeah, that was 220. I'm gonna use 320 and just keep going up. I have 400, 500, 800. I don't know. Just keep going. So this is three. Wait, this is. Wait, what, what this is. Yeah, 320. This 320. Just keep going, I guess. So it's smooth. I don't know. I've never done this before to a car. A car part. I don't know. Maybe this is how you do it. thousand grit sandpaper um, like I said I've, I don't know what I'm doing honestly but I know that I messed up with a drill and the only way to fix it is going up with uh, with the grits so I mean if, if you know if you know what I'm doing is wrong all right please let me know cuz just in case I don't know I just want to know like I hate not knowing if I'm doing this right or not I know it might come out better though. I hope it comes out better. I hope it comes out better than uh, than it did before. And I'm pretty sure that it might because I mean I've I've done sanding on wood and it kind of works like that where you use like the the less grittier the smoother it is. Um, so yeah, I'm at the, I'm at a thousand grit right now. I went from 
the drill to 220 to 320 to 400 to 500 to 800 to 1000 now I got two more I, like I don't know if I should do the other two like I wish I knew cuz if I if I'm just like doing extra work for no reason you know like I, I want to know I want to know that's a NF reference uh, he's a rapper yeah, so please, please let me know if I'm doing this wrong. Like, am I supposed to go like that? Like, in, like you know, not much of gaps between grits. You know what I mean? Like, could I have gone 220 to 400? And then from 400 to 800 and then to 1200? Like, I wish I knew, man. I wish I knew. That way, you don't have to waste all this time. And it's getting dark. It's getting pretty dark. Check that out, check that Hey, well, the sun's gone, but, but it's not a, not a sponsor. Get out of here, water bottle. All right, so I'm about, I'm about done with a thousand. Now I'm gonna go to the 1500 or 1200 and then uh, 2000. And, and that's all she wrote. Well, not me, not yet. So what's next? Uh, 12, 1200. I said 12,000, did I say 12,000? I meant 1200. I meant 1,200 guys, not 12,000. I think I saw, said 12,000. 1,200. And with 2,000 is probably how I'm gonna end the video, cause I don't want to record for that long. I hope I hope this video isn't too long. Um, so this is 2,000. Airplane? Oh yeah. So yeah, this is where I'll leave off the video. Obviously, I didn't finish uh, sending it, but in the next video, you'll see me. Well, you'll see it how it, how it looks, uh, hopefully done. Um, maybe I'll have a chance to paint it tomorrow, but I mean, my next video, I probably won't record it till, um, till Saturday. Um, so yeah, uh, thanks for watching, and stay tuned for another Honda video. Also, if you know, if, if I'm doing this right, please tell me in the comments, please. Like, I wanna know that I'm doing this either right or wrong, please. So thanks for watching and stay tuned for another Honda video. Are you looking at their plan? Yeah. Okay, bye.